Oh, hello. We're right there. Jeez, I didn't know it was just a hop, skip, and a jump away. Bathhouse, right? Now I mentioned that. Yes, it says that right there. My quest thingy. Knock, knock, -y. Anybody there? Open up. Hey, Jerry's filthy. He needs a bath. Come on, open up, huh? What's Maybe you need to do a secret knock. The bathhouse is closed. Need to talk to the owner. I know he's here. I'm not sure that matters, as he's terribly busy. Don't care. Tell him Geralt of Rivia wants to talk to him. I cannot promise Mr. Rubin we'll have time to see you. Wanna bet? <laughs> Very well, I shall try. Please wait. Oh, I thought we were gonna actually bet there. I was ready to bet everything. Whoa. Siki Rubin cordially invites you to join him. I'm happy. That head does not fit with your body, sir. What's going on? You have the head the of a fat man, but you're not all that fat. We will pass through the dressing room so you can leave your clothes. Let's go. Oh, I see. I see how it is. They're gonna disarm me before I go in here, right? Yep. Clever ploy. That's how the gangsters do it. You made this robe here. Your equipment will be safe. Happen the eunuch? Right. Okay. And we're naked. No swords. Splendid. Oh, I got, I got my spells. Siggy Reuven awaits in the next room. All right. Uh oh, Hi, them's Fire. boobas. Nice bum you have. <laughs> yep. You were right. We got he boobas. Flush. No sir, I don't blush. Oh my goodness, there's boobas everywhere. Everyone avert your eyes, there's boobas everywhere. Oh my goodness. Who would have thought there would be nudity in a bathhouse? Hello. Easy, Jerry. Cleaver. Or son Junior's a dead man. I'll have my scribe send you a notice. You don't have a scribe. And we'll eliminate Junior when, and only when, all of us say I. Jerry's here. Reuven, your guest. Hi, boys. Why the fuck you let him in here? Because I want to talk to him. This is Geralt of Rivia. Good to see you again. Do I know this As guy? As always, I'm out of the swiving loop. Who the fuck are you? Nah, I'm, I'm none of your business. None of your business. Your friend got a death wish. <laughs> no, just short on manners. Witches aren't exactly the sophisticated urban types. No, sir. Got intruders. Someone just snuck inside the bathhouse. Several men. What the fuck's he on about? Plowing fortune teller. Assassins! Assassins? Please, no. Oh god. Ah! Oh, they're beating up the naked ladies! Bloody Why hell. would they do that? I fucking knew it. Any weapons tucked away? Just a few. Oh great, fantastic. God, what am I gonna do in editing with this debacle? Oh, this is an absolute mess. Mace, Jerry? That's what we're going with? Alright, you're the witcher. First ever body with my prick hanging out. Ah! All right. Let's hope it's the last this one, huh? Orson's henchmen. All right. Let's get some. These guys are fully clothed. This is hardly fair. You get naked. Not too late to surrender. Okay, hold on. I know axie tricks. I should really be doing that. Hold on, boys. Hold on. I know all sorts of tricks. It'll be good. Except everyone's dead already. Well, that was hard. Oh wait, there's more. Oh boy, there's more. <laughs> oh boy. We need one alive. I thought I. Re oh, we need one alive. Got it, man. See, I got this one. Take out your buddy for me. <laughs> Love Axie. So good. Okay, there's the one alive. No, no, he's a dick now. Okay, got him. Hold on, boys. Good work, gents. Terribly sorry for that incident. My security failed. I'll get to the bottom of who, why, and how. They were whoresons, scum. 
That's the bottom of who and how right there. Don't start that again. Especially not in front of our guest. Who pranced in right before they attacked. Coincidence? Why do I doubt it? That is a tad Let's suspicious. Give him a chance to explain. Yes, Jerry. Uh, Axie time? Listen, I don't believe I know your friends. Not gonna introduce me to your friends? Good thing happens not here. He tanned the hide on my ass for being so rude. Francis Bedlam you know, but then who's not heard of this patron of the fine arts and supporter of entrepreneurs of limited initial means? And the dwarfs Carlo Vares, known also as Cleaver. Carlo's in entertainment, mostly. Oh, he's the other boss of the city. I got it. Uh, Horson. I gotta talk to him, I guess? I'm looking for Horson Jr. Interesting. What do you want with him? Mm, personal matter? I don't want to reveal it's personal. too much stuff to these <laughs> jokers. Uh, Geralt takes his privacy very seriously. Spying on him, having him followed, was a bloody nightmare. Still, <laughs> he was lots more trusted when he was looking for Marigold. Gentlemen, you out of your fucking minds? A chat session? Horse son's out to get us, and he'll succeed eventually. We've got to kill him first. So by all means, you sit here, soak, fart, and watch the bubbles rise, while I send my boys to Horse Sun's hidey holes. They'll make some noise, flush the bugger out. All right. And you, geriatric, or whatever your plowing <laughs> name is, want to find Horse Sun? Find me first. Okay. <laughs> well done. I think I've referred to you as geriatric as well. Jerry. So, yeah. Uh, where do I find Junior? Any clue on Junior's whereabouts? Be grateful for any lead. Siggy? It's worth a try. Geralt's got a knack for finding people. And he's discreet. A value in itself. Leave you to it, then. I'll, uh, look in on you tomorrow, Francis. Finish our talk. So how about we get dressed? Sure, sure. Then we'll talk in private. This guy sure seems to like you, Jerry. He's vouching for you Rye all over the that place. Was. Never thought I'd be glad to see the man responsible for my taking frequent baths. If you're any cleaner for it, gotta say it was worth breaking your ankle. It healed poorly. Can you believe it? I must soak it in hot water at least six times a day now. Failing that, it bloody pounds like the bells of Beauclair at dawn. Right. Uh, oh, apparently Jerry broke his ankle? Oh, whoops. I had my reasons. Your leg would be fine if you hadn't gotten in my way. I see. Well, I promise you that if I could go back in time, I'd do things quite differently on Thanid. For example, I'd have my men kill you instead of just tying you up. Listen, Reuven. No, Dijkstra. Just not in the mood for your code names, passwords, and other bullshit. I'm here on specific business. If you want to listen, listen. If not, I'd rather you spared me your wit and threw me out now. Ah, uh, what's the harm? Talk. Think Cleaver will find Orson? He might. He might not. But he'll burn down half the city trying. What waste. Leave him to it, I say. Work alone. Any ideas? Junior's got areas of the city where he's strong. Penetrate them, look around, but be discreet. None of this speed and fury and swinging your steel cock about. Well, that's my favorite thing to do. So, we want to avoid this gang war? Because I feel like we just got trapped in it, and I'm not opposed to that. Pretty clear you and Bedlam don't want a war with Junior. Why? Let me tell you what I told King Vizimir time and time again. War doesn't solve any problems. It breeds trouble. Trouble you then have to solve by other means. Make no mistake, someone's behind Horson's actions. I'll not end him until I know who. Very well. Um, right. Apparently I have a past. I'm not aware of it, but I'd like to know all about it. Your partner's aware of your past? 
They know you're Sigismund Dijkstra, former head of Redanian intelligence. <laughs> Cleaver, Bedlam, and Junior. Well, I'd call them our partners if we'd built a mill to grind flour for the folk of nearby hamlets. But we just need to stay out of each other's ways, agree from time to time. That doesn't make us partners. Do they know who I am? Was. Bedlam, sure. The others most likely suspect. But we just don't talk about it. No need to. All right. Horson. What's he on? Where's he from? Hmm. Makes sense to ask around, I guess. Junior might be in hiding, but he's got to be collecting income. Couldn't afford to cut himself off. Gambling. That's his big earner. Junior controls the largest casino in town. I'll never forget. Hierarch Hemelfart raised all kinds of hallowed hell there once. Bugger bet lost his ruby ring. Then there's the arena in the city's bowels. Betting scheme generates near as much as the casino. They're always looking for hired muscle there. Suppose you could always search Horson's house. Though I doubt you'll find him there. Maybe some clue, though. I could loot his house. Where's his house? Mentioned Horson's got a house. Where is it? Solid townhouse on Temple Isle, just on the other side of the bridge. Wouldn't wager me knickers on finding him there. Junior's not that stupid. Right, that's the place with all those witch hunters and eternal fire jerks. Uh, arena? Oh, there's an arena. Arena sounds promising. Where's that? Sewers beneath Gildorf. But you'll have to enter through the pits. Endure the stench of poverty on the way. That's now, okay. Junior loves a good fight. Wager he'd give a lot to see a real witcher in action. Yes, I'd like to get in some arena action too. Uh, casino? Where's Junior's casino? Near the Temple Watch Towers. Horson's got nought to do with a casino officially. So careful what you say. Try not to arouse any suspicions. Alright. Time to bounce. See if I can't find Horson at the casino or the arena. Might talk to Cleaver as well, though. Do what you will. Just be cautious. Horson's expecting payback, I've no doubt. Thanks for your help, Dijkstra. Just go, Witcher. And if you can't find the slimy bastard, come and see me. I know him well. Might figure something out. Uh, oh, wait. Do you know what happened to Dandelion? Listen, Dandelion's missing. Any idea what might have happened to him? Same thing that happens to anyone who steps on Junior's toes. Meaning? Dead? He's surrounded by splendid virgins who ply him with sparkling wine and pastries stuffed with nightingale's tongues. Come, Geralt, what do you think's happened to him? I reckon he's at the bottom of the pontar, trussed up with the strings of his old mandolin. It's a loot. loot. Yeah. As far as I'm concerned, he might as well be rotting down there with a goddamn trombone. Right, um, you got beef with him? You wouldn't happen to have a bone to pick with Dandelion, would you? Of course I do. Are you serious? Dead serious. Dandelion published a sonnet recently. Second stanza, the shit uses paired couplets instead of an inserted rhyme. What? Surely you understand how deeply offended the poetry lover in me was. The bastard shan't get away with it. Well, th I... Clearly understand your fury now. As am I when I say I have exactly no time to worry about your gigolo boyfriend. Got me own problems. Problems you might be able to help me with. Oh man, here we go. And if you did, why then I might be inclined to ask after Dandelion. Establish what happened to him. Fuck, this guy seems like a real scumbag. I don't know if I want to hang out with him. But if there's money involved... I'll get paid on top of that, right? Nothing for free, eh? Did you bargain this hard when Emma wanted to hire you? Um... Do we play coy? Let's play coy. No idea what you're talking about. You are the worst liar I have ever known. Glad I don't need you to win a poker game for me. But we've chatted enough. Yeah, I'll pay you. Count on it. So, can I count on you? Well, I guess we're working for gangsters now. When did this turn to GTA? Shit. Whatever, I'm down with it. Maybe I can help. 
What do you need? I'd rather show than tell. Pictures worth a thousand words and all that tribe. Ah, and you do realize, if you say anything about what you see here to anyone, it'll mean a razor between your ribs. Figured as much. Excellent. One last request. Oh, let's call it what it is. A command. Don't draw your sword unless I ask you to. All right. I don't know what we're getting into, though, man. I, I could use some details. Oh, there's a secret passage underneath this bath, isn't there? Classic, classic trick. They did this in Dragon Quest VIII, too, except it was a fountain and many other Dragon Quest Be games. Be so I think. kind as to follow me. Sure thing, boss. Ow. Oh, that must be the leg you messed up previously, Jerry. Uh, I don't know the story behind that. I imagine it's from, I don't know, Witcher 2. Hold on, there's a bunch of herbs around here. What, what, what kind of herbs we got around here? Hand fiber. Is that good? I don't know what that's for. I'm gonna get some of it anyway, just for grins and gigs. I honestly don't know what herbs I need for what potions nowadays. I haven't consulted my alchemy bits in quite some time. But, okay, that's enough. Let's go down this, this uh, sewer? The sewer? Guess it's a sewer. Some kind of sewer. Wait. Is this where you keep your treasure? That's totally what happened to Dragon Quest VIII, too, except moles oh, got into it. Not again. Bart. Bart? Bart, what? stop that. Now. Bart. 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 Bart makes Ziggy lose, Jonathan. Beating your head against the wall won't change that. Is this your mom? Bart, <laughs> Bart less thinky. You have lovely mother Bart, visit Jagger, whatever your name is. But sadly. Uh, so your mom's a troll. Where'd you get the troll? From Zerikania. Won him. Card game with a camel merchant. Your jokes are getting better by the minute. See me smiling. I'm dead serious. They gave but away some weird I things in this world. Don't be horses. Hot there. Siggy bad tay. Good, Ziggy. Right. I can't understand your mother. Can you translate? Don't seem to have trouble communicating with the troll. Why'd you bring me down here? Take note of that hole. We'll come back to it later. Is that your mother's hole? <coughs> you see that hole? <laughs> Vault behind it until recently filled with Novigrad crowns and countless other valuables. But God! Then boom! Chorfun, go! Translating into common, someone fucking made off with nearly 20 tons of my gold and all the lighter stuff, and you will help me get it back. Uh, right. You, uh, you're not capable of doing this by your lonesome? Why don't you handle this? Gotta have connections in the underworld. What do you need a witcher for? Uh, the gold wasn't mine alone. See, I run a members-only savings club, a bank for the initiated. For reasons that should be obvious, I prefer it if my temporary liquidity problems remained private. So I need an outsider. I How see. do you know you can trust me? I don't. Counting on your survival instinct. Slip up, and I'll kill you. Feed you to Bart. Bart, sorry. Bart job that good. It's okay, um, Mrs. Vizelnik, or whatever your son's name is. Let's do it. Fine. I'll help you. You're not exactly bursting with enthusiasm. Witcher mutations. They strip us of emotion. I'd be jumping for joy otherwise. Nah, <laughs> sarcasm. All right. Ought to look around. But first, some questions. I'm all ears. Uh, witnesses. Well, I... Well, other than Bart, I'm guessing Bart was the only witness here. Anyone see what happened? Other than Bart, no. And the vault's location is known only to the treasure's co-owners. Well, and the thieves. What about upstairs? Anything unusual happened in the bathhouse the day of the break-in? No. Happen swears it was calm as ever. 
The usual customers, no incidents. Bloody bucolic. I don't know what bucolic means. I'll be sure to look it up later. Uh, how much? You said like 20,000 tons of gold or something? I don't know. How much was it all worth? Got an approximate idea? Why the fuck do you care? Figuring your finder's fee. Yeah. Don't get your hopes up. I know you too did. well for that. Just prefer to know what I'm looking for. Three crates of Nilfgaardian florins, a chest of emeralds, rubies and topazes, silver candlesticks and platters. I could go on. Shiny Chorfin. Oh, God. Got it, Shiny Chorfin. I'll get on it. Take it the thieves got in through the hole behind you. You're a regular fucking master sleuth. Well, thanks. Any other brilliant deductions you want confirmed? The year, maybe? Bloody name of Redania's king? No, uh, but I, I am wondering, remember. for instance, Radovid? how that hole got there. Oh, no. Boom. Hole. Bad look won't go. Bad look no. Only sleep. Bad shrooms head fall. No, those are good shrooms, man. You just have to, you know, ride that snake, baby. Bad mushrooms? What's that about? Pops mold. The spores are highly toxic. One whiff and you're dead. Unless you're a troll, that is. Yes. But. But. Troll. Wait, you're a troll? Not talking to you, News to me. Where was I? Ah, mold spores. They cover the walls of the sewers other side of the vault. Actually thought it was a good thing, you know? A bit of extra protection. Thieves found a way through it. Bart, you see them? Bart, you hole. Once see, boom, got what? Breathe, shroom. Sleep, go. Jorfun, gone. Bad. Now, now, stiff up a lip. He doesn't have lips. In fact, how's he pronouncing bees? I don't even know. Uh, care to elaborate on the boom? Boom, starting with a B that requires lips to pronounce. So, like, peas as well? Go ahead and display your uh, language skills, buddy. Boom. Can you elaborate? Boom! Big... Uh, this like... I'll elaborate. Explosion. Big enough to blow that fucking hole in the wall, separating the vault from the sewers. Gotten pretty good at communicating with this troll. Lots of prior experience. Worked with idiots my whole life. Hmm, yes, me too. Try to track down the thief yourself? Of course. Hired this lummox, Fonce, thick enough not to ask questions. We knocked back some pops antidote and entered the sewers. Soon after, I returned alone. What happened? Lad started belching something horrendous. I mean, burps with so much mass the walls shook. Told him, Fonce, stop. You're in the presence of a count. Well, former count, but still. And then he puked up. Up came most of the antidote. Lost his protection. Tried to pull him out. Then I heard a bubbling. Something crawled out of the water. Fucking drowners, right? I value the lives of my men. I do. But I value me own even more. Dropped fonts and ran like hell. Right. Uh, guessing it was a drowner, but I'll ask anyway. Mind describing this something that crawled out of the water? No. Doesn't mean I can, though. Air in the sewers thick with spores. Can hardly see a thing down there. Must have noticed something. Was it? No! Didn't notice a fucking thing. Didn't do a taxonomic field analysis either. I know it's an inconvenience to you, but I felt I should get the hell out of there as fast as I could. Alright, no need to get testy, man. Just trying to get all the info. Let's go look in these sewers. Should look around the sewers. Got any more of that Pops antidote? Have a few vials left. Got the formula too. Disgusting swill, to be honest. But it'll save your life. Here. All Thanks. right. You've no to thank me for, literally. You're no good to me if you suffocate. 
Listen, I'll be upstairs if you need me. Sight of this empty vault's giving me an ulcer. Good luck to you. Yes, thanks. Good luck to you and your lovely mother. <laughs> oh, right. Your lovely mother's gonna stay Dandelion, down here with me. What the hell have you gotten yourself into? Yes, indeed. 